So you have a vehicle that you want to bring over to another map. I'm just going to use this uh, truck as an example. Um, right now it has 2.3 hours on it, not much. But let's say you want to just make this your own truck and keep on moving it to a new map. So I'm going to save this game. <clears throat> that game was save game one I was on. So right now I'm just going to make a new save game. Say that this is your new map you want to go to. I was going to pick Elm, pick Elm Creek just for an example. All right, so you get your new map loaded up. You can see I own nothing. So I'm just going to save this game. And that was game save four. So I want to move my truck from game save one to game save four. All right, so you're in your, your game folder and you see your save games, go to your save game my mine is save game one. Go down to the bottom, you will see vehicles. You want to right click and edit. I use Notepad. <clears throat> Scroll back up the top. So if you want to search for it, let's put Ford. That's what it was. This is not the one, so let's go again. So that vehicle was the Ford 350. You start at the beginning where the vehicle is. It's gonna hold down left click. You want to keep going all the way down, keep going. And you have the end the vehicle. So highlight all that. You right click, click copy. It's going to minimize this for now. So go back to your game. And the game save I want to move it to is game save four. Again, go down to your vehicles, right click, edit. And you can just put this in, I think anywhere. So if you find a vehicle, go into the next one and after this and type some spaces. <clears throat> and you want to right click and paste. So now that truck vehicle from my saved game one is now in my saved game four. Don't forget to save it. Close this. 
and we can go back into the game and see if it's there. All right, so we go back here. Let's go into game save four. All right, so let's go into the map. Go to your own vehicles. And it is there. Yeah, the same amount of hours, same configurations. Now let's see if we can find it on the map. Now I'm sure I'm doing something wrong. It's probably user error. But it's showing the truck right here. All you gotta do is if I'm back up far enough. So I click on it and reset it. And there you go. Now this is, for some reason, it comes into the your new map dirty. So just wash it. And there you go. You can keep on... Same configuration, same hours. Now I think you can just, if you wanted to, just change the hours of the truck. You know, to, as long as you own it. I think you can change just the hours. Um, but it's easier for me to just copy the whole code. So that way it keeps the uh, same configurations. All right. Hope someone finds this useful. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like. And I will see you next time. Take care. Have a great day.